Trying to rebuild after a storm or a fire is tough, and that's where groups like Texas Baptist Men come into play. They've spent the morning helping one family in need. Suzanne Bruner live this morning in Grand Prairie with those details. What are they doing now, Suzanne? Yeah, Kara, we are seeing about 40 volunteers with Texas Baptist men cleaning up this home here in Grand Prairie after it caught fire back in January. You can see right behind me all the progress being made right now. They are clearing out debris and soot in and around this house. They filled five of these large dumpsters already, but we did get a chance to look inside of this house and looking at the progress where volunteers say the fire heavily damaged the interior. The goal is to get it all cleaned out so that builders can restore store it and the family can move back in. It's been six months since the fire and the family has been back out here to see the progress this week. It's been very special, honestly, to be able to know that we're making such a big impact for them. Um, I don't think they expected this type of response and help. And um, I'm just grateful that we could get so many people together that were willing to come out and support them. Yeah, a lot of support out here in Grand Prairie. Texas Baptist Men has a number of teams dedicated to helping people through devastating situations like hurricanes, tornadoes, and fires. As a matter of fact, they're in Amarillo right now helping families after flooding in that area. But back out here, volunteers have been working on this home for the past couple of days, and they are preparing to be out here all week until they can get everything out of this house so that builders can come in and restore it and get ready for the move in process. But as always, Texas Baptist men, they are looking for volunteers. Again, this is all volunteer work. So if you are interested in helping out, you can visit their website. That's tbmtx.org. And there you can sign up and learn more about their mission. Carol, I'll send it back to you. Yeah, they're always helping someone. Thank you so very much, Suzanne. I'm glad we could shed a light on them.